Hi, I'm Pastor John Glover here for another ministry moment to help your ministries move forward according to God's will. In this third of six videos, we are thinking about post-COVID trends in ministry. The COVID restrictions are over, but people are still adjusting to the quote, new normal. In this video, we look at sabbaticals for church workers post-COVID. I had an incredible experience with a three-month sabbatical to Israel and Europe. It was an unexpected gift. My colleague was retiring, and he told me that I would be very busy and probably stressed as a senior pastor. So a sabbatical was an opportunity to reset before I stepped into that lead role. My colleague was not kidding. Being a pastor is a 24 hour a day, seven day a week, 365 days a year kind of vocation. A pastor very rarely gets real time off. They're always on and are always available. The pastor is always adapting to new situations. In 2020, 2021, pastors and other church workers were called to adapt rapidly in many ways they might not have been used to doing. Churches, worship, and programming shut down temporarily. New technologies were implemented, and with them, new skills acquired. As one person said, many church workers became tele-evangelists against their will. Often, church workers were put in the middle of debates over vaccinating or not vaccinating that fell along partisan political lines. They had to mediate accusations toward vax people who were accused of not trusting God, on the other side, vax people accused the skeptical of not using the gift of science that comes from God. On top of it all was the shadow of death. It's always been a part of ministry. During COVID, it seemed that initially the number of those who died was greater in a shorter period of time. In a way, pastors and ministry staff have experienced a form of trauma in the wake of COVID because of a few things that I just mentioned. They're tired spiritually, physically, and mentally. They're dealing with COVID's effects in the life of the church and in their own lives. The need for a sabbatical post-COVID is just as urgent as it was pre-COVID. Last fall in Ministry Moments, my colleague Tom Egerbeck made an excellent case for sabbaticals and gave some practical steps toward implementing a sabbatical policy for church workers after seven years of service. I think of these extraordinary circumstances, though, consider these steps. Speed up the timetable for a mini four-week sabbatical for your church workers. Tap key leaders who have the resource to supplement the sabbatical. Seek third source funding, if necessary. Proactively tap your ministry staff on the shoulder and encourage them to take the sabbatical now. Help plan coverage for the mini month-long sabbatical. If you'd like more information on planning a sabbatical, we're here to help. Connect with LCEF's Grace Place Ministries, your LCEF District Vice President, or email us at ministry.solutions at lcef.org.